right, let's move on to question number six. An open market purchase is where the Fed, A, purchased government bonds from the public, thereby decreasing the money supply, B, purchases government bonds from the public, thereby increasing the money supply, C, increases the money supply by selling government bonds to the public, D, decreases the money supply by selling government bonds, bonds to the public, or E, none of the above. Now, one of the clear-cut things that you can take away from this is that D is, right off the bat, decreases the money supply by selling government bonds to the public and increases the money supply by selling government bonds to the public because right over here it already says open market purchase. An open market purchase is always buying. Buying is the opposite of selling so C and D are automatically out. So yeah, C and D automatically are out because selling this is not what the Fed is doing on an open market purchase. It's If it said an open market selling then these would be would be considered correct but since it's not selling it's buying or purchasing C and D are incorrect now the federal now let's review the question uh, the federal reserve is purchasing or the federal reserve has the power to purchase or sell government bonds and that can affect the open market by uh, the selling government bonds leads to a decrease in money supply and buying government bonds leads to an increase in money supply. So like I said, C and D are incorrect because the Federal Reserve is not selling um, government bonds. Uh, a is incorrect because purchasing government bonds will not decrease the money supply but it would increase the money supply. And also, E is incorrect because the Federal Reserve's purchase in the open market does affect the money supply. So therefore, B purchases government, uh, the federal government, the open market purchase affects the federal, federal government by purchase, the purchasing government bonds from the public, thereby increasing the money supply. Now B is correct because if the Federal Reserve is purchasing, in the open market, then money supply would increase.